It's not where you would traditionally find beehives, but beekeepers are now using rooftops in Paris to harvest honey. The skyline of the French capital is now abuzz with the insects. The number of hives here has risen to 1,000. As farmers say, the overall bee population in France had dropped over the winter. In June, beekeepers staged a funeral to highlight the number of bees that are dying off. This is one way of getting around the problem, and the honey produced in Paris shows no sign of one of the worst things about city living. There are no traces of uh, pollutants in the honey. There are some in the wax and especially in the body of the bee because they filter their environment. The honey is perfectly pure, more so than in some places in the countryside. Uh, that's what's crazy. On the roof of Monet de Paris, the honey is called liquid gold and it's used at the restaurant Guy Savoy. Its namesake is a Michelin three-star chef and he's a big fan of the honey. Du cuisinier. The dream of any chef is to have their products at arm's length, or in this case, at finger's length. It's incredible, actually, to be in the heart of Paris and to have hives on the roof. That's how I realized that in Paris there are so many flowers, that we have a honey of exceptional quality with a beautiful complexity. Bee colonies are better protected from pesticides, predators and parasites in Paris. And while beekeeping in the City of Light is a welcome move to try and save France's bees, more still needs to be done to preserve them in rural areas. Asad Beg, TRT World, London.